why I decided to start driving is because I wanted to be able to do something that most impacts the patient out of all the activities that the VA listed as volunteer activities. He walked in. He said, I want to volunteer. And I said, great. And he told me he was a Vanderbilt student. He said, but I only want to do one thing. I want to drive veterans to their appointments. I said, great, we, we need that. But being a university student, you know, what's your availability? And he says, well, I'm about to be a senior and I know I've got Fridays open. I'll be here. Being a friendly driver, asking them about their day, listening to them as they talk, not even just about their like military service or uh, medical condition, but talking about stuff like their interests or their music or their passions, stuff of that nature, listening to their life lessons. It makes a difference. It makes them feel heard. It makes them feel welcome. It's just very fulfilling to be able to serve people in such a fundamental and simple way. When veterans see his, his youth, his enthusiasm, you know, you, you see your future in that. And with his path in medicine, you know, he's here to demonstrate that I, I care about people. I want to help somebody. I think it's wonderful. I mean, he's, uh, he's doing a service, especially to take his own time out. He, he never went into the military, but he wants to still help the veterans. So I think it's a great, great thing that he's doing. I think he found something that he really cares about. To every college individual, I would say that it makes sense to volunteer. Veterans come in all shapes and sizes from various different backgrounds. And part of growing as an individual is being able to understand and interact and empathize with people unlike yourself. Being a volunteer, pay you back in more ways than you can think.